Hey, this is Rick with Scottsdale Urban Farms, and we got an update on our our new project <clears throat> in Phase One. This uh, is going to be home to our 55 new tomatoes. Um, I'm going to mound. I've uh, got the irrigation ditches that I'm going to run irrigation to, but I can also come in and flood. And we've got these rows that I can easily walk down this path over here and run the hose uh, for nutrition <clears throat> and get deep root feeding. We're going to leave the pepper and the herbs that we have over there. This area here, we're going to run mounds this way. Uh, the opposite direction and I believe that we're going to uh, do companion plantings. We're going to have herbs in there, we're going to have flowers in there uh, that are detractants for uh, anything that wants to come in and uh, mess with our tomatoes. We'll also have intermittent plantings of um, companion plants within our tomatoes out here. And we're super excited. I mean there's there's nine varieties of heirlooms that we are going to plant and um, with the sole purpose of harvesting, selling, and uh, harvesting the seeds so that we can create a seed bank for future generations for not just our family but anybody else that is interested in uh, whatever variety of heirloom that they like. So super excited about this grow and um, it's going to be fun. Tomatoes can be finicky. They're a uh, vegetable, fruit vegetable that um, likes wet feet. They go through different stages, pre-flower, flower, pollination, um, calcium. There's a lot of things that can happen, tomatoes, uh, end rot, blight. If you water the tomatoes uh, too much, if they get any kind of foliage, we're going to be experimenting with compost teas out here and get really, really aggressive with the nutrients. Uh, and this is all natural, all natural. There are no uh, chemicals in here uh, that are not conducive or organic for, for plants. So hope you uh, enjoy this video. Let me know in the comment section, you know, what, what you do, uh, the mass growers. Um, or even the two or three or five or con uh, containers. Uh, you know, what, what, what success uh, strategies do you have for your tomatoes? Um, it's, it's coming on March 1st, and we're looking to have a really, really fun tomato season. Take care, everybody. Have a great day, and God bless each and every one of you.